Guys, so we're at Al Maida once again. You've probably seen us before together. We've done a video already, but we you know what? We are brothers after all. <laughs> Exactly. So today we're going to go to Almada. We're going to check out some of their food because honestly, every time I come here, I absolutely love it. And I thought I'd do a full video showing you guys what they have to offer, what I like the most. Uh, and Ali, and also I get to just hang out with Ali. That's really the main goal here is to just show this you guys is, us hanging out. Channel, so I'm just so, yeah. fun, guys. I love this guy. We're going to have fun. Right. So we've taken a seat. It's not too busy today. So we managed to get a seat straight away, which is good for me because I'm super hungry. I can almost smell the food right now. So I'm going to go up and get my first plate. So this is the salad area, which I'll be honest with you guys, I am going to completely and utterly skip because I ain't about that healthy life. It tastes good, I'm but I ain't about like that. Zodi, I'm going to obliterate the lasagna. The only thing I get in the salad area is ketchup, which is made of tomatoes, so even though it's a fruit, hmm, I don't know. So I know it's an Asian place, but you've got to get your chips in there, guys. They do have masala chips, which are really nice. And they've got these. Just it all, you like it? Yeah. So Ali's already getting on his first plate. He's yeah, getting. 100%. And Ali's done. That's that's his plate done. So they have lasagna here as well. As you can see, it's very popular because it's always good. And also pizza. So I'm going to get a slice. And then they also got a gold copper section. I'm totally going to come back and make some of these because banging. So these are banging. And these are banging too. But I don't know which one I'm going to get. I think I'm going to get. I think I'm going to get some of this one, the meat one, because yeah, let's get some of this. And my niece is going to get a chicken one, so I'm going to grab her the chicken one. And we're going to plop that right there. There we go. So I'm just going to show off some of the items because I'm not going to get everything. But I think it's good to just show what they have. These are really good actually. I really like these. Um, there we go. Yeah, this is probably one of my favourite things here. Very meaty, very flavourful. So first plates are here. Yeah. Uh, can we move this a little bit closer actually? Yeah. Just move it closer. Yeah. Hello guys. Come you can closer. hear us. I don't have a mic yet guys, so I apologise for the audio. Abdul, come closer. Come closer, all right, now move back. Is that back What's the best buffet in Manchester? Almeida. Ah. Gala, gala, bingo. Gala. Bingo? I don't gala. know. Gala. Oh, I don't know that one. I know that, yeah. Anyway, first plates are here. Uh, I want a bit basic. And I've got like basically chips, pizza, um, just all that good jazz, so. Let's give it a go. I'm actually excited to try this because this this is one of my favourites anyway. And it's like cooked really softly today. Looks cooked really softly. I asked him how it was cooked. Cooked well. Cooked well. Mmm. Ali's hungry. It's been devoured that way. I want the protein. Mm. That's hungry. really good. It's made really well. Big piece of chicken. Soft. Flavoured well. I love that. Protein. Something that I don't tend to get is actually the chapli kebab. I've got a meat one today. Did you get chicken? No, no, no. I've oh, got a meat one as well. I don't, I don't like the chicken one. Apparently chicken makes your stomach less upset. I don't know if that's mm. true. Chicken, so. a little bit of ginger, better for your stomach. Ooh! Really oh. good. So I've been to Almada quite a few times, and I've been honest with you, I haven't been getting that, and I don't they're know really why. Good. You can see the onions in there, but there's little bits of tomato in there. They're, quite, they're really nice. They're, bit, they're on the greasy side, but honestly, it's a kebab. Mm. It's going to be on the greasy side. Imagine that in a little bap. Yeah, that's actually ooh, roll. Ketchup idea ketchup for the guys here. Add a little bit of bread on the side, guys. Like, like a, a bun little, kebab. Yeah, a bit of bread, something like that. Put some chips in there, some masala ones. Moving on, got some masala chips as well. Sorry, I'm keeping it a bit short because there's quite a lot of food to go through. And really, I just want to show you guys the amount of variety they have here. The what's masala the, chips are really good. They're not as good like? as Noir ones, but they're really good. This I'm going to get added to taste test this. Ooh. See, Charles loves potatoes in my batter. Maybe not for me. I like my mum's one though. I've yeah. not really had because they're like, like thicker, them? like thick potatoes. Masala like really fish is the best masala fish in any buffet. Yeah, yeah. That is quite good, but mum, if you're watching this, yours are way better. So, but sorry, going back to the, the masala fries. That's one thing I do agree with. Um, I love the fries here, but yeah, Noir masala fries are a lot nicer. They're quite thick, mm. and they've got like a thick layer of masala on it. The pizza here is pretty good as well, though. But just wait for a fresh one to come out. Okay, so we're gonna do round two. So I'm not gonna get the veg spring rolls or the veg here, but they are pretty good if you do like them. Got some fish masala. Ali absolutely loves the fish masala, but again, I'm not a huge fan. Um, and then you've got chicken for it as well. These are fresh. Got some lamb. I've shown all this before, to be honest. I always come back for the things that I like because that's the point of a buffet, right? You get the things that you absolutely love. So got that. But I didn't get this last plate, so we're gonna get some of this. 
Okay. Now, as this is my second plate, I'm actually going to get some curries this time to go with my starters. Let me show you some of the curries they have here. Obviously, that's your alva and your chole as well, which I'm going to be having some of that later. Uh, we've got some more curries here. So, we've got some vegetable stuff. So, here we've got like chicken, chicken jalapeno. So I have to say, they've actually got quite a lot. And then obviously it goes into random pasta and rice dishes. And you've got your naans there. You've got some sag as well, which is in nice little dishes. And then we've got some dal as well. So yeah, if you like your rice, I'm not really about that. I like naan and rice, uh, naan and curry to be honest. But the rice here is actually nice, especially the lamb one. Got some chicken biryani which Ali was just about to go grab and I stopped him. No, he wasn't. You don't like biryani, do you? Yeah, he's weird like that, but then neither do I. I don't like biryani. Got your lamb today. This is actually really nice. Of course, I'm never going to forget that. You've got some more chicken curries here. Got some more. So, guys, honestly, they've actually got loads of curries here. So, if you like your curries, you're not going to be disappointed here. What I'm going to get, Ali wants pathological za. I'm actually going to get some of this. Remember guys, don't overeat. Nice little small portion there. We can always come back and get some more. However, I am going to get a little bit of chicken as well. If you don't like mixing meats and you find it weird, then I'm sorry for you because it's the best thing. Especially a chicken, uh, sorry, especially a meat dish and a veg dish mixed. Bang. Now let's just grab a couple of these. That should be enough. Boom. Guys, the second plate is here. By now, I usually have my olive pudding which is like my favorite thing. Next. But we're getting that next, because I absolutely love it. So second plate, it's a bit of curry, it's a bit of starters again. As I said before, don't overeat, don't go crazy on the dishes. Don't be grouchy this year. There's a lot of curries here, so it's quite normal to want to try everything, so. But you want to save yourself, because they do fresh made donuts at the end. Like literally, you can see them being made. Yes. You want to save yourself. Yes. And also, if you've had a lot of food and you're like, oh, I've barely eaten, then you can go crazy at the end, because you're like, yeah. I've got a bit of room, I'm going to eat all my favorite things. So let's try a bit of the kima. Are you a dessert guy, actually? Mm. I don't really know that. I love dessert. I'm not sure why I don't know that. I'm not massive on dessert. Mm. I like crisps and savoury salty stuff. Yeah. I would say I used to be a lot bigger on dessert, but now I tend to get quite full on food, on savoury food. So by the time I get a dessert, I just want something small, something light. That's why I like a croffle. Because it's like I a. I like Taz's wife is chatting to you behind the camera. She is. When you say I'm not a sweet person, I see her laughing. What do you say? So you say you know him very well, but you don't know if Dessert. She said, apparently I know very well about competition going on here, guys. Look, I can't help that your husband loves you more than you. <laughs> it's not my fault. You know what I mean? You've seen your first fight on my YouTube channel. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> but it'll be a beef on YouTube, yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're going to make a response video. Like, what I really think about, blah, blah, blah. I'm not going to do that. But yeah, second plate is not too different. Curries are really nice here. I've never had a chicken pukoro. A chicken pukoro is really good. Mm. I've never had that flavor before. I actually got a chicken pukoro today this as well. This is my first. That was actually really good. Do you know what, funny enough, first, my first time too. Oh, we're really sick. Oh, I forgot to get ketchup. That's right, we should. We should. Oh, well, I've had ketchup. It's oh, right. that's one point to my wife. Because that's one chicken point to my wife. Is, uh, ketchup, which is vegetarian. Whoops, Daisy. Like, now you can't use a ketchup. Like. Doesn't care, she loves me too much, she doesn't care. These are the chicken grigions. These are really nice, yeah. So, good I missed out my birthday, good but protein. really good. So we're now gonna munch this up and I think I'm ready for some alva pudding. Maybe some more starters before going on to dessert, but I cannot wait for the alva pudding because that is so good. My favorite part of this place, of the buffet, is the alva pudding. So let's go get some. So last time when I came with my brother, I didn't get enough of this. He was like complaining and then he wouldn't let me go back up to get more. So I'll make sure to get enough this time because he's such a baddie. But also actually, I just realized he likes I know he likes this as well. So, oh, that's a lot of oil. We'll get a little tiny bit of that for him. Boom. Now we just need the puris. So this is where the magic happens for it. Look at that. Lovely bit of oil. Oh, it tastes great. If it's fried, you know it's gonna taste good. Little snacky poos, because sometimes- That looks very similar to your first plate. Yeah, you little snacky poos. This is the strategy, guys. You come in, eat what you want, you pick a few different things. At the end, you've got a limited belly room. You pick your favorites. Why? Because you want to end the meal on a high. Then, you go for dessert, but before- Wise that, words. You've got to get pop it off. There's basically Asian crisps in it. Literally. This lighting is doing you a lot of justice, bro. Looking, looking very, very nice, y'all. Thank you very much. Woo, look at that. It looks banging. And oh, Ali's taking my plate. Do you know what? I <laughs> Seriously? There's three people. Look how much you have in Jono. You've got three people. Guys, I did it again. 
I literally told you on the video that I'm gonna put enough in there because last time he had a go at me. Where's the John? And he's done it again. Because I forgot, to be honest, it's my fault. I forgot about my niece. I forgot I should be eating as well. Okay, so now this is the finished plate because you know I didn't add enough. And then we've got her hoodies here, which look amazing. I can't wait. Guys, so I clearly messed up again and I didn't put enough chickpeas in and alva. I underestimated my brother. But also, in my defense, not my defense actually, the opposite of my defense, I forgot about my niece. I forgot that she's gonna just give me evils right now, but I forgot that I need to give enough for her as well. So that was my fault. But it's here now. I'm super, super excited to have some. I'm glad you like it. Thank you. No problem. Take care. Honestly, man. That just always hits me differently. Oh. Honestly, it always just hits me differently. Yeah, I've not had it yet. Yeah. <laughs> really She's like, oh, lovely. No. And then we've got some. I thought I'd try some of the chickpeas. That's good, but I much prefer the alba. But I know what Ali's gonna do. You can't, you know, you can't beat it when you mix the chana, the alba, and the buddy all in one. Yeah, hundred oh. percent. Got more mixed up now. So I'm feeling pretty full now, but we're gonna go out for desserts. I'm gonna get something small, but I'm hoping some of the other family members get stuff and I can show you guys what they have. But me personally, I might just get something small because that alba puli dummy over, man. It filled me up. Sweet rice, gajola. I do like gajola, actually. Bit of ice cream as well, banging. Glubbies. They've got all of this as well, which is quite nice. I tend to avoid these because they are good, but I tend to save my belly room for some of the other stuff. And then obviously you've got your ice cream. The ice creams here are actually pretty good. But let me show you the best thing that I think they have here because I've not seen this anywhere in any other dessert place. So check this out. So they have fresh donuts here. So you can get your crepes as well, but fresh donuts. I have not seen that in any buffet before. So let's get some of these. Yeah, if you want some crepes, you can make some fresh crepes here. I personally just want the donuts if I'm going to do. So we've got three donuts and we're going to get some sugar on it and some chocolate sauce as well. Look at that, piping hot, fresh. Amazing. I've had them before and they are absolutely delicious. Thank you very much. Thank you. Look at that guys. Oh, I can't wait to eat some of that. So I love bubblegum ice cream. If you don't like bubblegum ice cream, you need to grow up because it's the best ice cream. I have it with my donuts. So I'm taking too long guys because Ali's getting impatient. He really, really wants some of this donut. Go on, you can have it now. You can have it now. Go on, guys. Other people must feel like when I want to record. Oh yeah, we've got some donuts in this house. We've got some donuts in this house. We've got some taste in this house. We've got good. 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 So there's me trying to set up a camera and all that. I forgot my niece also had a donut. So she just stood there. Corner, just going, I literally just... <laughs> literally holding a spoon like this. <laughs> she was just sat there like this. So I forgot. You all one plate. I apologize. So I'm gonna try the bubblegum ice cream first. As I said in the video before, if you don't like bubblegum ice cream, you need to grow up. You, you need to, yeah, you too. My niece needs to grow up. Oh, that's so good. And then we're gonna get some of the donut. Guys, I'm about to try a donut, but for some reason, my wife has a bit of ice cream and a tea bag. But why? <laughs> no, you gave me a plate. No. Why is there a tea bag on a flip? <laughs> and no one laughs, you know it's a bad day when the punchline's hit you. No, that, that, is the, that is the punchline. That's why you quickly divert to the food because it's bagging. Yeah. I love the I love that donut. It's such a great way to finish your meal here with a bit of ice cream, a bit of donut, a bit of grigiola, a bit of everything really. So yeah, we're gonna finish up our food here and I'll give you my final thoughts outside. But spoiler alert, loved it. Guys, that takes me to the end of the video and I thought I'll do it in front of this flower wall because I never take pictures in front of the flower wall, but might as well do that today. I had an absolutely amazing time. I, every time I come here, I always have a good meal. For me, this is probably my favorite buffet in Manchester. So if you haven't been before and you're visiting, please check these guys out. So that takes me to the end of the video. If you enjoy the video, please follow the channel, subscribe, like, share, comment, do all those good things. And I'll see you guys in that next video. Peace.